today we're gonna make chicken salad. So first things first is to zero out your bowl on the scale. Scale says zero, not getting the weight of the bowl. I'm gonna take my chicken and I'll weigh 44 ounces. I'm gonna take the chicken and I'm gonna rip it by my hands. By the way, my hands have been washed and cleaned thoroughly. And I'm gonna pull some in the food processor. You just want small enough pieces so that it's not big chunks so everything grinds up smoothly. Do about three pieces, maybe four if they're smaller, in the food processor at a time. So there we go. Put my lid on, make sure it's all snapped into place. Hear the click and pulse it. I'm gonna pulse it until it's kind of in a consistency but not gummy or pasty. So we're gonna dump that in here. Put our bowl back on, make sure our blade's back in place. Now we have our chicken all ready. Yep. Nice big bowl. Now I'm gonna get my almonds and my cranberries in there next. I have dried cranberries. It's gonna be one cup of dried cranberries. Fill it in. One cup of sliced almonds. Add a cup of mayonnaise. Flatten the top, kind of mush it in there. Make sure it's full. Into the chicken bowl. There we go. Now salt and pepper. It's gonna be half a teaspoon of each. and salt. Now I'm going to grab a glove where you can use the spoon and mix it up. I'm going to really make sure that the mayonnaise and salt and all the ingredients are mixed up thoroughly. Should look like that. Should be kind of compactable because of the mayonnaise. And then it goes into a tall hotel pan. And then what you would do next is plastic wrap it, date it, and label it. And put your initials on it. 